Buff machines are known for their decorative stitches. And when it comes to doing the eyelets and bar tacks, there is, they do not disappoint. So in the eyelet section, stitches one through four, usually on most machines, you just get a plain old eyelet, one eyelet, but nope, not this one. I was just playing with some of the eyelet stitches on this fabric just to see it, how they would look. And there's even one I haven't stitched just yet. But when you pick it, it does tell you to put foot 2A on. I do recommend some stabilizer under your fabric, otherwise it can get a little distorted. But speaking of distorted, do you know you can actually make it longer and you can have oval eyelets. You can also make them bigger. So just because you uh, see the size doesn't mean you have to live by the size it sets. But when you put it in, all you have to do is push the start stop button and that eyelet is just gonna stitch out one time and you can then use the scissors. Awesome, easy and try all of those out. Now, when I've done eyelets, I've usually just taken my scissors and physically just pushed and opened up that little opening so I can weave uh, a ribbon, a cord, or something through there that I'm actually needing the eyelet to be used on. So try out, remember, stitching out all your decorative stitches will truly give you an idea of what is in this machine.